Hi, I'm James from Madison's Residential and I am recording my day today as I head up to London on a particularly frosty morning. It's minus four at the moment. Um, but I'm about to go and get the train uh, from Tunbridge Wells at 7.18 to head up to London to Earl's Court to meet with um, fellow independent uh, estate agents, uh, particularly those involved with lettings. Deborah belongs to uh, a similar group who are uh, involved in sales um, and we both find these days really really useful so what I thought uh, is that I'm going to record various snippets of the day uh, and uh, tell you what we've been up to and what we're expecting from 2023. I'll speak to you later. So here I am just arrived at London Bridge and London Bridge underground station is closed because of overcrowding. The joys of coming to London. So here I am in the offices of uh, TLC. You can see it's a really busy space, and here are all the uh, property academy groups and the travel from afar. But it's a really, really beautiful office. It's a great breakout area for the staff. And then the offices go around the other side of those bars. Petitions, as you can see, it's dog friendly, and their dog looks remarkably like the Madison's team dog. Right, we're making our way over to the hotel now, so I will report back in later. Hi there, well we've just broken for lunch, had a delicious lunch uh, at the hotel. Um, so what have we been doing this morning? Well typically the days are set up that every other session we have a guest speaker along. Um, today we haven't got a guest speaker, uh, but uh, for example at the last uh, meeting we had, we had um, somebody who was a, a former SAS um, uh, serving officer and um, he talked us uh, an awful lot about what talked some fascinating, had some amazing stories about his life in the SAS, um, but we learned an awful lot about resilience and dealing with uh, problems, problem solving and so on from him. Today is um, all about the issues that we've uh, brought to the group, so issues that perhaps we have in our own businesses, what's going on in the market at the moment. Obviously 2023 is um, uh, just started. There are issues with increasing rents, landlords feeling um, under pressure, uh, with uh, increased mortgage rates, tenants feeling under pressure, uh, with the uh, spiralling costs of living. So. Um, we're all, none of us, whether we're up in the Lake District, down in Tunbridge Wells or in central London, we're all experiencing the same issues, so it's how we're dealing with those. And it's fantastic having an open environment to discuss those. Um, so this afternoon we're continuing with that um, issue debate uh, and I will uh, report back in a little bit later on as to what we've discussed. Uh, but so far we've looked at um, recruitment, uh, one of the companies is uh, struggling on a recruitment side of things uh, and also in terms of office space somebody's uh, been offered a business and, and new business premises and, and should they be taking that on at this particular time so it's led to some fascinating discussions uh, so it'd be interesting to see what comes up this afternoon and uh, as I say yeah I'll report back to you later. One of the things we are asked to do at the beginning of each session is to um, score out of 10 how we are feeling in ourselves, uh, so personal score, um, how we see the business at the current moment and what the outlook for the business is. And so what this photo is showing you is how everybody has scored themselves uh, at the start of today. Hi there, so the day is now finished. Uh, you can see a few of the hangers on in the background there. Um, really, really fantastic day. Brilliant afternoon session uh, where we covered uh, all sorts uh, that is going to be affecting 2023 from the Rented Reform Act uh, to EPCs to uh, rent reviews uh, and all sorts of really, really good stuff. So um, I certainly look forward to uh, returning to the office uh, tomorrow and um, getting uh, a number of these things implemented. Um, always find these days uh, super helpful and uh, look forward to sharing some of the knowledge that I've gained today with you uh, over the coming weeks.